Hey guys, welcome to ASA Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to disable Windows 11 blue screen restart loop. If you were stuck in a frustrating Windows 11 wood loop, no need to panic. In this video, we are going to show you a quick and easy fix to disable automatic restart so you can finally diagnose and resolve the issue. So let's get started. First, you need to get your computer into the Windows recovery environment. Here's how you do it. To trigger Winery, interrupt the startup process three times. That means as soon as you see the Windows logo, press and hold the power button until your PC shut down. Repeat this two more times. On the fourth startup, Windows should automatically enter the automatic repair mode. You should now see a screen that says preparing automatic repair. Once it's done, you will be taken to a new screen where you will select advanced options. Next, we need to access the command prompt. Here's how to do that. Select troubleshoot from the menu. Then go to advanced options. And finally click on command prompt. Now that's we are in command prompt, let's stop Windows from automatically restarting every time it encounters a blue screen error. This will give you a chance to see what's going wrong. Now type the command bcd edit space forward slash set space start curly braces default close curly braces space recovery enabled space no and press enter. This command disables the automatic restart feature which means that instead of rebooting endlessly, your PC will stop at the blue screen error showing you the specific issue. Don't worry, also I will show you how to re-enable it. We can take this a step further by bypassing certain boot failures that might be preventing your PC from starting up. Here's the command to do that. Type the command bcd edit space forward slash set space start curly braces default close curly braces space boot status policy space ignore all failures and press enter this tells windows to ignore specific errors that would normally stop it from booting up it's a handy trick that might just get you back into windows finally let's exit the command prompt and restart your computer to see if it worked Simply type exit and press enter. If you are lucky, your computer should now boot up normally. And now you can diagnose and troubleshoot further. Here's a detailed tutorial on how to diagnose a blue screen of death on Windows 10 and Windows 11. If not, don't worry, this is just the first step in diagnosing the problem. So what if your PC still doesn't boot up or you are faced with the dreaded blue screen of death? Let's talk about diagnosing the issue further. Take note of the error code on the screen. This is your key to understanding what went wrong. Common error codes like inaccessible boot device or memory management point to specific issues like a failing hard drive or bad RAM. You can search in our channel for these error codes and you will find specific troubleshooting steps for each one. Check your drivers, run a memory diagnostic or even try booting into save mode to uninstall recent update. And I'm sure one of them definitely helpful for you. If this quick fix helped you out, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more quick tech tips and tricks.